We're going to have a little fun with our last mock draft. Now, this was a, a Madden simulated draft uh, by the EA Sports Madden one, and they have the Browns getting Jeremiah Owusu Koromoa, um, a linebacker who's kind of more like one of those hybrids that is more of a safety, a rover type. I think I'd be okay with that, too. Because And now you're getting this, and I don't know if people think this way, but like Micah Parsons, I think, is the best. Everybody agrees that's the best linebacker in the draft. It's possible that when the Browns pick, they'll be taking the second linebacker. So it's like, like all right, well, you're getting the second best linebacker in the draft. Maybe it's him, right, who's a little bit more of that hybrid. Maybe it's Collins, who's more of an edge guy. Maybe it's Nick Bolton, as the, the voicemail person suggested. Those are guys, maybe it's, uh, I can't think of the, the Martin guy from Kentucky. That, or is it Davis? Davis. No, yeah. No, no, yeah. Like Jemaine, What's his name? Jermaine Davis. Davis. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Okay. That's it. That guy's been mocked to the Browns a lot, right? So maybe, I, I do think more of the linebacker options will be there at 26 than cornerback options will be there at 26, but I think a cornerback option will be there. So they might have a good group of linebackers to choose from. And again, I think when you say positional value, all right, a first round linebacker is that positional value compared to edge rusher, offensive tackle, quarterback, cornerback. No, but late first round, when you're getting a really good player that you think you could just put on the field for five years, I do think that that is its own kind of value. And then they would just have to find that other outside corner buffer for greedy they have to find him a different way. So I do think we're in the right. I like the linebacker cornerback options more than that defensive tackle, for instance, that was like the first mock you brought up. 